Hey guys, welcome back to another super motivating video. And if you're new, I'm Jamie. Thank you for taking time out of your day to hang out with me. So today you're in for a super extreme whole house fall deep clean with me. I'm also going to be decorating my front porch for fall. I spent two days cleaning my entire house. I was decorating my front porch all while my kitchen was getting renovated. And I'm gonna give you guys a little sneak peek of the process and how that was looking while I was doing all of this cleaning. But on the first day, this was two days before the painters came to paint our kitchen cabinets. So because of that, I wanted to do some deep cleaning. I wanted to deep clean my kitchen before they came. And I had planned on deep cleaning outside and using my power washer, which is one of my favorite things to use. And then I was going to decorate my front porch for the fall. And on day two, when the painters showed up, I spent the day cleaning upstairs the entire upstairs and deep cleaning our master bathroom so a lot of deep cleaning motivation a lot of decorating motivation and i'm also going to give you the little sneak peek of our cabinets while i was cleaning and i'm also going to be trying on a new bathroom cleaner that i cannot wait to share with you so a lot jam-packed into this video Do you guys see how we have the dark hardwood floors and the dark kitchen cabinets? I finally got tired of having such a dark kitchen. So we hired painters to come in and paint our cabinets white so they would be white and bright. So I will have the kitchen reveal here up here on my channel really soon. But like I said, I'll be sharing with you guys a little sneak peek of what it looked like when I was doing the cleaning that you're seeing in today's video. I honestly don't think I've ever been so excited for something to be completed in my life. It's just going to brighten things up, brighten up the kitchen and make everything look bigger. Make sure you guys come over, find me on Instagram. It's linked down in the description, but it's jamielins.journey. I'm sharing more about my kitchen renovations, more about my home updates over there. So I was just putting away all of the clutter from the countertops, unloading the dishwasher before I started actually cleaning my kitchen. And to wipe down my countertops, I was using the Jaws Granite Cleaner, which is one of my go-tos and favorite cleaners for my countertops. It does an amazing job and you'll see a shine here when I'm done. And the smell is really light, fresh, and clean. And I think the smell is one of the main reasons why I love using the product other than it working really well your attention you make me nervous in the corner of my best friend's sofa you were getting by some rum and cola wasn't brave enough yet just to talk to you not a smooth talker under pressure sweaty palms ain't making 
But I do want to thank Jaws for partnering with me on this video. I've been using Jaws products for about nine months. And if you are not new to my channel, then you know I have been using them in every single video since I started using them nine months ago. So it is truly an honor that they would want to work with me. And I stand behind their products. They are wonderful and one of the main reasons why i like them is because they're always in stock i can always get them when i need them they're super easy to use and they are quality products so jaw stands for just add water systems so you get these bottles and when that cleaner runs out you just fill the bottle up to the line where it says fill water to here drop in the pod and you have a brand new cleaner on your hands so they take up less space and jaw's mission is to eliminate single-use plastic bottles and like i said i know a lot of cleaning products are really hard to find right now but when i go to the jaws website they always have them in stock even the disinfectant and they have a new foaming bathroom cleaner that i'm going to be trying out later in this video and when i clean our master bathroom and let me tell you it is one of my favorites i love foaming bathroom cleaners i think they just clean better so stay tuned for that but i'm really excited that they launched this new product recently if you want to try the jaws cleaning products out you can use the link in my description and a coupon code for 25 percent off so use my link and then code jamie25 for 25 percent off So to wipe down the stovetop, I was using the Jaws Kitchen Degreaser, and it's really nice for an all-around kitchen wipe down. And as I was cleaning, I noticed there was some taco meat stuck between the countertop and the stove. So I wrapped a baby wipe around a butter knife, and it allowed me to get in those cracks and get all of that taco meat out. I think it's one of my favorite cleaning hacks. And then I was also going to use the degreaser on my twins' high chairs because they had made a mess with their peanut butter and jelly after lunch. And there was some food on the actual cabinet because they're messy eaters. I love using this product specifically on the high chairs because it is non-toxic. I've been holding on, I want to let you go. Cause every time I try, you find a loophole. I've been slamming the door and just leave you cold. When I come back, you've heated up the south. If you guys are new here, I'm Jamie. I'm a mom to three young girls. I have a five-year-old and twins who are one and a half. I am married to my high school sweetheart. And I hope when you guys come to my channel, I can add some value to your life, whether it's motivation, entertainment. Hopefully I can give you a tip or two, maybe a cleaning hack, something that can make your life easier. I know life is not easy, but I'm here for you guys. We are going to get it done, even if it's little by little. And I would love to have you join my journey. So think about subscribing and definitely say hi if you're new.
So before I decorate my front porch, I wanted to do some deep cleaning out here. So I busted out my trusty old power washer. I love this and I love power washing things. Make sure you stay tuned for a sneak peek of my kitchen and how things are going in there with the white cabinets, but they were inside working away. So it was nice to come out and get some work done while they were in there working. It was still a little bit nice out. So still nice to get out here when it's still warm enough because it's going to be cooling down here pretty soon. I live in Northern Ohio and it stays pretty cool or I guess comfortable until about mid-October and by Halloween it is coats, sweatpants, it's pretty cold by Halloween. share this handy window cleaning tool with you guys I've used it so many times here on my channel but I love it um, I think I got it from Lowe's and it's really nice because it's on the stick right here um, it has like this microfiber cloth that you just slip right on and so you can go and clean your windows really good and then you have this squeegee at the end um, so after you're done cleaning your windows you can go and squeegee them so there's no streaks. I'm telling you, this works amazing. So I'll have it linked below if you guys want to check it out. But like I said, I got it from Lowe's, but I know you can get the same ones from like Home Depot or pretty much any other hardware store. I really love cleaning windows and I don't know if that sounds weird or what, but I do. I think it's probably because I clean the inside of my house pretty much every day. You know, at least picking things up and wiping things down and cleaning the outside. It's just different. So it's exciting and new to me. I think that's why I like it. We don't have to say much. Let our lips touch. I will stay with you until the end. Meet me in the back.
so the porch is clean the windows are clean and what I'm gonna do now is kind of let things dry a little bit more I'm um, dry out here before I decorate and I'm really excited I just like laid everything out out front and I can see everything and I'm just I'm excited I cannot wait to decorate this front porch so we will be back in a little bit after we let the porch dry a little bit So I will tell you, the goal with decorating the front porch was to try to make it be on budget as possible to not spend too much money, but I will have everything linked down below in the description if I can find it. But I got this rug from Amazon and then the hay bales I got from Walmart as well as the pumpkins and the fake, fake pumpkins that you're going to see me decorate with here in a minute um, I got from Walmart as well and it just kind of took me a while to kind of play around with the decorations and make it all work I feel like sometimes with decorating you have a vision and it just flows exactly how you thought it would you know flow and come together really well and this project was a little bit harder so I played around with different pieces and made it work if it's over to say it out loud say those words go I did steal this sign from inside my house. I love it. I got it about three years ago from Kirkland's. I just felt like I needed a sign out here that I didn't have one. So I pulled it from inside, put it here. I love it. So I have to decide where I want it more and whichever place I um, keep it, the other place that I don't have a sign, I'll try to keep my out, eye out when I'm outside shopping. this wreath from Joann's um, and it was like I feel like $12 I got it on sale and I thought it was a steal because wreaths can be super expensive so I was just so happy when I was able to find a wreath that I thought would look good on my front porch and that was a good price if it's over, we've been laying his for a and I will have more pops of orange when we go to the pumpkin patch. We'll bring back some real pumpkins and put them here on the porch. Treatment is this what it feels like. So what do you guys think so far? It looks pretty different already, doesn't it? So I'm thinking the kitchen reveal video will be up next Sunday. So mark your calendars, make sure you have the notifications turned on. I am so excited, but they were done for the day working in the kitchen. Um, and I figured I would do some deep cleaning in the front hallway. And I was using the Jaws hardwood cleaner to wipe down the baseboards, give them a really good clean. And then I was going to go in and wipe down the walls in that front hallway. I actually hadn't planned on doing this, but when I was down here cleaning the baseboards, I noticed all of these marks and spills, and I don't even know what was on the wall. So I grabbed my rag, I used some warm water and some Dawn dish soap to wipe down my walls. And that's one of my favorite ways to clean the walls because it cleans them and gets scuff marks and greasy fingerprints off of the wall without taking off the paint. 
And then when I was done with the wall, I had planned on vacuuming the stairs and wiping down the banister, which is something I don't do as often as I should. And vacuuming the area that is between the baby gate on the stairs where a lot of dog hair collects. It's pretty gross, but it's real life. Can't say I like it, but I can fight it. Something's things not meant to be, even if it's hard to see. I'll try to let go. It's not easy, you know. Something's things not meant to be. Let's skip the apologies. Ooh, 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 ooh. But I can help that I miss you now, and I need to reminisce this cause. That I miss you now I can't help that I miss you now I feel like I talk a lot about this on Instagram and I know not all of you guys follow me over there but we are getting our cabinets painted obviously and then a couple of weeks we're getting new furniture delivered it's already been ordered and we're in the process of getting it delivered and then we're going to make small other changes like making or changing some lights in the kitchen I want to get some new bar stools curtains and a couple other furniture pieces for the living room so a lot of fun changes coming up here on my channel and I cannot wait to share it all with you. Sober, you say you don't like the games, but you play me like there's no tomorrow. You should know that. I'm fed up with your lies, so don't come closer. You know you hurt me bad and now you scars. I need some time to heal, so don't come over. Don't even bother calling, just get lost. I'm fine on my own. So this is all from the stairs. If I can get it to focus, look at that. All from those stairs. But at least they're all clean. Who knows what I called the stairs after I vacuumed them. Comment down below. So on day two, I was focusing on the upstairs because the painters were still working on the kitchen at this point. And if you're, you're going to see me using plastic cups and I had food up in the upstairs. I even think I have donuts in my bathroom. A lot of random stuff up here because we were basically living out of our upstairs. So I threw our sheets um, in the washer and the blankets before I popped into the twins bedroom. And as you can see, it was a disaster because we had been entertaining them up here while the painters were around. You can't have one and a half year olds running around paint painters. So we did send the twins to Mike's uh, mom's parents' house for two days, um, like during the day. 
but one of the days Mike's mom who doesn't work wasn't able to watch the twins so we had to have them at home so we just let them come up here and go crazy in their room. So really quickly, I came into the girls' bathroom. Um, do you guys see all that toothpaste? Like, seriously crazy. It blows my mind how messy kids can be. Um, and this is just one of my kids, right? So anyways, I was using the Jaws Granite cleaner and the disinfectant cleaner to wipe down the countertops. Normally, I would use their foaming bathroom cleaner, but which you're going to see me use in our master bathroom, um, which I do love it already. But I just got over a sickness. I was pretty sick the week before, so I wanted to disinfect. And with this disinfectant, it's really important to make for sure you let it sit for 10 minutes before going and wiping it down. So obviously you're not seeing me wait 10 minutes, um, but everything's sped up. So just so you know, I let it sit there for about 10 minutes before I go back and wipe things down. And um, with all of the Jaws cleaners you're seeing me use today, they're all non-toxic except for the disinfectant. But that's okay because we want it to disinfect, right? I was full of so much energy this week because like I said, I was sick the week before and I was just dragging literally all week long. I just felt like I didn't have any energy and I'm sure a lot of you guys know exactly what I'm talking about. I hate being sick and it's like life just doesn't slow down whenever you want it to, especially when you're taking care of three young children. So finally I was feeling better and I feel like I had 10 times the amount of energy that I normally do because I was coming down from such a low place the week before. Does that make sense to you? So I was full of energy and ready to clean, ready to disinfect and get my house back in order, I guess somewhat, because obviously my kitchen was still a disaster, but that's okay. If it's only for now, I don't mind, cause I know that your love is endless. If it's only for now, I don't mind, cause I know that your love is endless. It may be over tomorrow, but this day will live on Okay, so I was so excited to try out this new Jaws foaming bathroom cleaner. They just launched it and it's in the lavender scent. And I just personally love a foaming bathroom cleaner. Um, some of the other bathroom cleaners that I like, they are also near impossible to find. So I was pretty excited to try this one. Um, because I never have trouble finding Jaws cleaning products. And I first went through and sprayed everything down. I let the disinfectant sit for 10 minutes on the surfaces that I was using it with and let the bathroom foaming cleaner sit for a few minutes. And then I went back and wiped everything down. And I do want to add Jaws products um, have a scent to them. So like the bathroom cleaner has a lavender scent. It's not overpowering. It's not strong at all. It's just like a light scent that is really pleasant.
I must say, I was really impressed with this cleaner and you're gonna see me using it in my bathrooms moving forward because I think it's a really, really great product. Um, but now that everything is deep cleaned and not full of sickness anymore, everything is disinfected, I cannot wait to start using this foaming product on my countertops in the bathrooms. And don't forget, if you wanna try these products out, um, like I said, I've been using them for nine months, so I'm gonna tell you they're great products. I I use them in every single video. If you go back, you're gonna see me using at least one Jaws cleaning product in every video. Make sure you use my link and my coupon code for 25% off, save yourself some money. And if you try them out, let me know, message me, leave me a comment on a video and let me know what you think. you're gonna see how good it even did on the slider door. We had a lot of soap scum and soap stuck on the slider door and you'll see how easily it all kind of wiped up and how shiny it made the door. So I had forgotten that I didn't have any mops upstairs and I wasn't able to go to the kitchen and get my mops, go through the kitchen and get my mops. So I just did the old school, got on my hands and knees and wiped it up with some of my Bona ceramic floor cleaner that I had upstairs. So did the old school mop. here i will vacuum but the twins are sleeping up here so i don't want to vacuum i'm still waiting for my bedding to get done um so i'm gonna go ahead end the video here i hope this video was filled with so much motivation um if you guys decorate your front porch for fall make sure you send me pictures over on instagram i love seeing what you guys do and don't forget to check out jaws there is a 25 percent off coupon code in my description go check it out especially the foaming cleaner you need to try that out so I guess stay tuned for the reveal of my kitchen and I will see you guys next time. Bye.